The United Nations began during the Second World War in order to create a community of nations living in peace. There are four main branches, including the headquarters in New York City and the Palais des Nations in Geneva, Switzerland. The United Nations headquarters in New York City is known for the General Assembly, which is the principal organ that discusses and makes recommendations on any subject. It's also the largest body, and it's known for the Security Council, which discusses questions related to military conflicts and the arms race. Similarly, the United Nations in Geneva, or the Palais des Nations, is a large body that is known for peacekeeping efforts, humanitarian aid, and human rights resolutions. Here in Geneva, there are over 10,000 meetings a year on a variety of topics, including the Conference on Disarmament, as well as the famous Human Rights Council. In 1945, the Universal Declaration of Human Rights was adopted, proclaiming the equal rights of all men and women and of all nations, large and small. One of the greatest achievements of the United Nations was the creation of human rights law which is a universal and internationally protected code to which all participating nations must subscribe. With the combination of the Universal Declaration of Human Rights, which is also the most translated document in the world, and the human rights laws, the Human Rights Council was created to protect those rights. The United Nations has a broad range of internationally accepted rights, including civil, cultural, economic, political, and social rights, in which all human beings are born free and equal in dignity and rights. Human Rights Council monitors human rights situations in all countries and holds those nations directly accountable. Not only is the Council required to further develop international law in the field of human rights, it's also a place where each country has to undertake a Universal Periodic Review, or UPR, where the states has to fulfill their human rights obligations and commitments. During my time here, the widely contested Geneva II conference was happening, and it brought together both the Syrian government and the Syrian opposition to have a discussion of how to resolve the civil war in Syria. There were a number of protesters on both sides of the issue who were protesting outside the United Nations because many Syrians felt that the United Nations was not the right place to discuss the future of Syria and the future for its country. The Human Rights Council decided to take on this issue, and some found that it was actually very productive, while others found that the talks were far from the necessary actions in order to dissolve the conflict in Syria. Another hot topic during this time was the human rights abuses going on in Sri Lanka. A large number of European Sri Lankans gathered together at the United Nations to promote awareness of the genocide and other injustices going on in Sri Lanka. The Human Rights Council comes together four times a year to discuss these issues and to work to eliminate these injustices around the world.